Hey guys, it's Angie. Welcome to Sunday and I'm going to show you what sold for me over the weekend from Saturday morning because I shipped items out Saturday morning until today, Sunday afternoon. Um, I apologize if I feel look like I'm a little under the weather. Um, I unfortunately have the coronavirus. Wah, wah. It's big sad news for me. Um, my mom has had coronavirus for a few weeks now. I was really hoping that I wouldn't get it, but unfortunately, I have the corona. So um, I've had, had some symptoms. Um, mostly it's really bad fatigue and short of breath. Um, and I'm just taking it easy, but so that's why I haven't had a whole lot of videos out. I'm trying to get through it, but <laughs> I'm just slow going. So makeup free hair is a mess here i am um okay so this week i this weekend i had actually pretty good sales um for not listing a whole lot still 355 dollars. i have 18 items going out and like i said that's from saturday at around 11 a.m i finished shipping earlier and so that's just for the last two days I did um, Saturday morning run just a 10% off sale, which seemed to have has helped me quite a bit. So the first item that I sold were these six Sheffield dessert bowls. I literally never pick up um, any kind of pottery, ceramics, anything, because I don't know a thing about them. I've had these listed for well over a year, never had any interest, put them on 10% off sale and they sold today. So. Happy about that. I did sell these little cute Raggedy Ann and Andy 85th anniversary. They sold for $26.95 plus shipping, which is great. I sold this little Torrid blouse. This has been around since, oh, yay. Um, this has been around since the spring. I think because it's a size zero, which is like a 10, 12, is why it didn't sell. Um, anything that I get that's like a 1X and up, sells really fast but i think in that size a lot of people don't shop at torrid but i did sell it for um, a best offer of nine dollars i'm like let's get that thing out of here these are pulleys they're just ponytail holders they're kind of cute um i don't i got them from qvc palettes that i got for super super cheap and i have four of them all total and this one did sell for 11.65 these were Kenmore bags um, that I got on the Crazy Cats Boys 25 cent day. If you see here, it says three sold. Um, this person bought two sets, so like $21 for the two sets. And then I also sold this weekend, which I'm not gonna show you another listing, but I sold the other one. So I have 75 cents in them. I made a little over $30. This was a wah wah like, I saw Bermuda shorts. I've had these forever. Um, nothing special about them. I was happy that they sold for the $8.95 and the, they paid shipping. I always say you never know what's going to sell when. Um, sell them a lot of coats and things, but then in the middle of January when I know most of the country is having snow, not here in Florida, but um, I sell these Bermuda shorts. So you just never know. Um, this cute little, I guess it's like almost like a Red Hat Society. Yeah, it is right there. Red Hat Society, little bear. It sings and um, I put it on sale, $17.95. It sold for full price. This right here is Rusk, was one, one of my 25 cent items. So I got it last week, a week before last. Um, so it sold for $9.67. That includes shipping. Shipping will be like $2.60 for that. So this old navy jacket, I've had this for a while. Um, I got this at a yard sale for a dollar and it sold on my 10% off for $26.95. I only listed it about a week ago, so that was pretty good. This right here is a little bag of these parts. Also came from 25 cent day at Caz Boys and it sold for $26.95. <sighs> Sorry guys, I'm just out of breath. Um, this is a juice beauty mascara um it came with two items in the bag for the 25 cent day so really i only have 12 cents in this and it sold for 11.65 this i can't believe it sold because look at that picture <laughs> you can't even see what it is oh i was having an off day that day 
Um, but it did sell for $15.25 plus shipping, so good, good to get rid of that. This is um, a Keeper. Uh, it's a little wristlet. It was new. It's kind of cool. You can like attach attach it to like a chair or anything, so you never lose it. Like or someone, you know, it's not gonna, no one's gonna steal it from you. And I think that's the whole point of the bag. And it sold for twenty two ninety five. Pretty good. This I have zero cost in. Well, <laughs> I could say I have zero cost, but I was in a tournament on a Carnival cruise a little over a year ago. Oh no, last last spring, right before the Corona started. Um, my $150 entry fee got me this free hat and a free Coke. So, <laughs> um, and I sold it for $10.36. Hey, this is one of my costumes that I just got last week on Dollar Day at Cowboys. It went international. Um, I shipped it to Kentucky, $34.95. This is another item that I got in my QVC palette. It is the Hand and Paw Project. It's really cute. It's a human hand and a little paw necklace together. And it did sell for the $19.95. This is a Black Panther. He's kind of cool. You squeeze his legs together and his arms go, hyah, hyah, and he takes these sounds. <laughs> Sorry. And um, he lights up. Uh, Anyways, he sold for $14.95. And the next thing I sold was Mad Gab. This was our personal game we've had forever, probably over 10 years. Um, it sat on my eBay store for over a year. My kids were like, just get rid of it, just get rid of it. Well, it finally sold, I proved them right. $13.95 plus priority mail shipping. So this cute little um, cow pillow. Um, plush, he's really sweet, it's a big round ball. He sold for $12.95 plus shipping. And then this is just a filter, another 25 cent item for $12.95. And once again, another 25 cent item. And you can see the box has some damage, which I say. Um, and it sold for $20.95. So all in all, not bad. Um, actually pretty, go pretty good considering I've been feeling lousy. Now I will tell you that my kids will be doing my shipping for me. So I am not touching any of the products right now. And I am going to send my daughters off to Crazy Cas Boys this week to see what um, they get. We shall see. It could be a much different discovery, but they're pretty good at it. But they know I'm sick and, um, you know, we're going to see how that goes. They said that they would do that for me. Not too bad for sales for the very first weekend in the new year, um, except for the coronavirus. Um, having, you know, pretty good sales and pretty positive about what's happening with my eBay store and my YouTube. On Wednesday, I am going to have a live with Chuck, who is back road bitter here on YouTube. It's going to be his very first live. So we want to welcome him and I'm going to ask him some questions about his selling on eBay. And then on Thursday, I'll be doing a live with the cat guy, Bobby. I'm sure we'll come up with something exciting and fun to do. Maybe some games or something. We just like to do fun lives together. Hey right, guys, um, I'm going to head out. Oh, time for nap. I, this is exhausting me. Oh my gosh. Oh, I had to like stop. You can't see it, but I stopped the video like 12 times because I'm like, <sighs> I can't breathe, <laughs> but, um, getting through, getting through guys to stay positive, think good thoughts, have great sales. We'll see you next time. Bye.